Greeting awesome people, now I have the fixed head from Akaruka. I had issues with my other vid two videos actually, the one with the gym on the teeth, so they have fixed that now, I will show you. So here are the gyms, now they are visible at my teeth, you can look at them, you can change the color, and they now are back working, and that's awesome, you can also hide them, like I said. So this is something that has been fixed and it's out there. You can get the re-delivery re from the head store. And also they fixed the eye issue. And I was playing around with the eye appliers from Banana Panchi. And they did not apply on, on each single eye. So that now they are working. Like you can see now on the screen here. I can select this to be darker around the edges from the outside now or leave it white as I want so this applier from banana panchi and this works separately uh, not on both eyes now works as I mentioned but they did not work out the way I want so now they are working so back on the applier thing this I got in a gift and they target only the eyes and the iris so this is why it works on the area that it meant to be working on so i'm back at slag girl and i'm going to try to pick up other few appliers in here to show around how they work so i'm not a girl so bear with me i'm not good at picking something but i will not go for the unusual stuff like this one here i will get the demo for and this one also caught my eyes so I will get the demo for that as well okay this is for HD eye lips and then for the shadows eye shadows I will go for something simple I'm not gonna try to make anything out of it it's just an eye shadow so I'm just looking through I think I like these here they look simple and they might do the trick to show how the applier works so I have got three demos in here that I can apply on my head so the three demos are in my inventory so I will just quickly go and show you how they look like these are the HD lips so um on the demo version you have only this one luckily <laughs> they did not give me the chance to apply the stitched lips ones so a bummer <laughs> anyway so so here you go you just add these applier to yourself not wear because they are just gonna be like a HUD they gonna appear on the screen and then you can this is to try the shape of the lipstick so this is the demo shape here that says so you put, you only clicks on this HUD and you notice the effects right away appearing on your mouth because these are Akaruka appliers and this is again how the applier works they target only a specific part of the head with the UV maps so there is a UV map and this UV maps tells exactly where the tinted or texture goes over so in my UV maps I have UV maps part for my lips and this area here the script here tells and reroutes my texture to appear only on this area not a, not on anything else except for the UV maps that it's targeted with so that goes for the lips and now we're gonna go for these are the demo for the other HD lipsticks as well let's see how they go, go. I, I did double click so it didn't matter but eventually when you are wearing meshes you want to try to go from the menu and you click on add not just wear because that sometimes kicks out the other huts or other stuff you're wearing like the meshes 
So I'm going to show you how it looks like. Again, notice how this script, because it goes for the UV map as well, for the same targeted area, it kicked the previous applier out and got in its place. So that's why the other color has been removed and only this one appears and the other one is gone. So it's not like I deleted it, but the applier applied over the existing one and kicked the previous texture off and they are on right now showing me the present one that I, I just applied. So this is how appliers really works. You have, don't have to worry about that. You can save also from these areas that you like. If you like something that how you look like, you can go to the presets and save it. Or you can switch back to the normal height if you are not able to clear out this part. But I showed you in my video, if you notice that you can lipsticks. This is a HD lipsticks. So you can just go in here and you just turn it off or turn it back on or you hit clear to clear it out. So the eyeshadow as well. And let's see how it goes. You notice how the appliers works goes only on the certain area that you have targeted for the eyeshadow to appear and that's how it simply goes there's nothing to it because this is an Akaruka applier and it goes fine if you have an Omega applier on the other hand you might need the router the uh, Omega relay router that's gonna re reroute your texture and when you are applying an Omega applier it's gonna ask you where you want your texture to appear so it doesn't automatically do it as as i said if you are doing an akaruka applier normally the designer or the creator knows which uv maps he wants his um his texture to appear on so he has already done the work for you you don't have to select which place to place the texture on so and you notice that the eye changed and not the lips and the still i still have the lips here because of the layers they have separate layers for controlling the UV maps for the mouth, UV maps, UV maps for the eyes. So that's why the texture did not kick off the other one. So you can apply as many as you can as long as they are in a sec different segment of the head. And it's allowed by the head creator with the layers they have laid upon this mesh to appear. So once we have Bixon mesh kicking on the grid, this is things gonna change a little bit it's not gonna work that way with the UV maps still there but the the big sun mesh is gonna make it more um, usable like you can target as many as as you can now with you with big sun mesh but that's still not out there yet so I will not confuse the viewers it's, it's just as experimental with the SL and they will gonna release it eventually and it's gonna hit the grid and we will see more often people are asking about Bakeson Mesh stuff and things are getting suited for Bakeson, Bakeson Mesh like creator are making their meshes Bakeson Mesh Bakeson Mesh ready so that once again the, with the UV map helps I can target which area on my face that I want the applier to appear as you can see I have applied the demos on both my lips and my eye section eye shadows so this is how it works and if you have the Omega Relay router by Akaruka, if you haven't, just go grab it from the Omega store, Omega store, or from the Akaruka store or the marketplace. And this is going to be useful when you are applying Omega stuff. Omega stuff that does require you to have this router router available and wearable. Like, let me see. The And this is how it should be named in here. Okay, this is the not the kit. This is the the box. See, that's the kit here. That's when you unpack it. See, it says Omega System Relay for AK Creation. So let me find something. This Omega for the head, mm, face. So I have found something from. The Falling Gods ink, and this is going to be our example to see how it's gonna work. So 
so we're gonna minimize that out of the way and you can see on the Omega option the Omega applier they have the option default zone this is the default where it applies on every single place that it meant to be or with the hot control hot control that's you select the area you want to target by yourself or all zones that's gonna clear out everything I have on my face if I click that and the router is gonna ask me as well where I want to apply my I tattoo here so let me choose first default zone as you can see that did pretty much go well with the eyeshadow I have on my lips still intact and you can see the scripts are in local says where it applies so it kicked off my hair base if you notice my hair base is gone so we can try to bring it back on there you go so that might happen when you are applying some Omega stuff it kicks off something else but no harm done here much except for the hair base and I managed to bring it back on so if I choose the hot control it's gonna bring on the menu here and tell me where I want to target this texture on so I I will not maybe I will choose the tattoo again see nothing applying texture to tattoo and that's fine because there is a layer for tattoo and layer for eyeshadow and layer for the HD lipsticks so it's okay to apply it on tattoo because I know it's not gonna kick any of my hair base because this is a hair base layer is different than the tattoo different than the lips different than the eyeshadows so that's why I selected tattoo and as you can see it did not change much and let me choose the old zone thing to the whole head well so far it did not do much of a damage as well that's good so the texture is still on we have no problem with that because if you want to remove that the texture you would have to either clear it from here or you can click on here and no clear from this section some of the creators gives you as well like a clear option to clear your head if you are not able to clear it just try to figure out how the tattoo goes so this is I applied on my tattoo area so I can clear it by removing the tattoo it did not move it fully I think part of it is on the browse section I'm gonna clear that out okay and then some of the, that might be on the blush section as you can see it's working but fading slowly <clears throat> eyeshadow is gonna clear also my eyeshadow with the remaining parts I think in here see it's gonna HD lipsticks far from what I want maybe the cosmetic thing the eyeshadow okay that did remove it all so we can bring back on our applier for the eyeshadow again and there you go this is how she looked like before I applied the tattoo and we once again I'm gonna hit the old zone so you can see and this is how I managed to apply hair base eyeshadow and also the eyeshadows without the HD high shadows so there's a this, these two different layers here for the HD and for the normal eyeshadows so this is okay Let's see this tattoo is taking over two layers like it's, it's taking over the tattoo with the eyeshadow as well but not the HD eyeshadow so this is why I did not kick the texture of the HD out 
and still here and the lips still there so everything's still intact and they have fixed the eyes so please go to the store and get yourself um, like then the re-delivery the updated version with the fix it thing see you can now you can play with single eye you can color it as you wish and can play with the f reflections because that was also not working for me on my video so I hope you like this one and understand a little bit more about how the applier works and I hope to see you on my next one thank you for watching